As a student of microbiology, you will come across so many words, whose meaning appear to be almost the same. You always hear these words in combination, or separately. But, there is a lot of difference, between these words, and sometimes, the meaning is quite opposite to each other. It is very important to understand the definitions of such words, that usually make you confused. Let us make an attempt, to understand these definitions. Selective media, and differential media. Selective media allows only certain bacteria to grow, while inhibiting the other bacteria. Differential media allows to visualize differences between bacteria, based on growth pattern, and colony morphology. Mitosis, and meiosis. Mitosis results in two cells, that are genetically identical. Occurs in body cells. Meiosis results in four cells, that are genetically different from each other. Occurs in reproductive cells. Antibiotic, and antiseptic. Antibiotics are usually produced by bacteria or fungi, that kill, or resist the growth of other organisms. Antiseptic is a chemical agent, that slows, or stops the growth of bacteria, on the external surfaces of human body. Infection, and disease. The entry of microorganisms into the body, and multiplying within. The infection may or may not show symptoms. Abnormal function of body, with certain signs and symptoms, is called disease. Food spoilage, and food poisoning. Undesirable changes in color, taste, and smell of food, caused by microbes, is called food spoilage. Food poisoning is the illness, caused by eating the contaminated, or toxic food. Sterilization, and disinfection. Sterilization is a process of completely eliminating all forms of microbial life, by physical, or chemical methods. Disinfection is a process of cleaning, that removes most of the pathogenic microorganisms, from the objects, and surfaces. Yeast is a cellular fungi, that reproduces by budding. Molds grow in multicellular filaments, called hyphae, that reproduces via spores. Vaccines stimulate immunity in a person, against a particular disease, and thus shall be given to a healthy person. Medicines are given to the unhealthy individuals, to cure the disease. Toxins are produced by organisms, that cause damage to the host. Toxoid is the inactivated form of toxin, causes no damage, but provoke immunity. Respiration, uses glucose in the presence of oxygen, and releases carbon dioxide in water. Photosynthesis, uses carbon dioxide in the presence of water, and releases oxygen and glucose. Protozoa is a single-celled organism, that contains all cell organelles like an animal cell. Bacteria are prokaryotic that lacks a nucleus membrane. These are smaller than protozoa. Plasmids are the extra chromosomal elements, occur in the bacterial cell. Vectors are artificially introduced DNA, into the cell. Pathogen is an organism, that cause disease in the host, and can independently live without a host. Parasite needs a host to complete its life cycle, and sometimes cause little damage to the host. Oxidation is the reaction, that removes electron from the substance. Reduction is the reaction, that adds electron to the substance. Magnification is the ability, to enlarge the object from its original size. Resolution is the ability, to distinguish between two objects that are very close. Higher the resolution, greater the detail. Lag phase. In the bacterial growth curve, where cells start multiplying slowly, and adjusting themselves to the environment. Log phase. The phase, where the bacteria population doubles. In vivo. 
Any experiment done within the cell. In vitro. Any experiment done outside the living cell. Flagella are lengthy, and functions in bacteria motility. Fimbriae are bristle-like structures, that help bacteria attach to surfaces. False positive. A result that shows an organism, which is actually not there. False negative. A result that does not reveal the organism, which is actually present. Epitope. Part of antigen, where antibody binds. Paratope. Part of antibody, where antigen binds. Epidemic. A disease that affects a large number of people, in a community, or region. Pandemic. An epidemic, that crosses the boundaries of countries. Endotoxins are part of the cell wall, and released when bacteria dies. Exotoxins are secreted by bacteria, as a result of their metabolism. Diffusion. Movement of particles, from the higher concentration, to the lower concentration, until equilibrium is reached. Osmosis. Movement of solvent particles, from low to high concentration, through a permeable membrane. Bacteriostatic, prevents the growth of bacteria. Bactericidal, that kills the bacteria. Antigens are external particles, that enter the body, and induce antibody production. Antibodies are produced, in response to the antigens.